Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Destiny and today I'm taking you thrifting. Let's go. Here's my little thrifty fit of the day. Skirt and bag were both flipped, which I'm making a video about. And then cardigan was thrifted. The cami is rat boy. And the hat is something my husband gave to me. And let's see. The boots are just cheap Target boots I got on clearance. Chicken macaroni. Are you singing back there? <laughs> Levi, are you ready? Yes. Let's go. All right, let's go thrifting, guys. So basically, we're just gonna be going to my local Goodwill. That's like one of my favorite places to go. I don't know if you guys have kids, but my kids love to go thrifting. All three of them. I have three kids, so. Where are we going, Levi? To the thrift store. To the thrift store. Da -da -da -da. Do -do 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 -do. A gua. A gua. Let's see. It is 10.06 right now. Um, I am kind of an early bird. I love to go thrifting in the morning time, or really like for any chores. If I'm gonna do any chores, like a doctor's appointment or anything like that, I'm gonna go in the morning time. Um, I just feel like it's different. Like the vibe is different. People seem friendlier in the morning. Um, it's just like more relaxing. Usually places are less busy. If I'm gonna be productive, it's gonna be in the morning. Cause come nine o'clock, I am passed out on my couch. Going to the thrift store, baby. So, anyways, um, I'm not really going to the thrift store for anything specific today. I basically was just going for some inspiration. I'm actually working on a video for you guys right now. It's basically going to be like nine projects in one or something like that. Um, where basically I take you know, nine pieces that I thrifted and flip them into different pieces. But the one that I'm working on right now is not really turning out how I wanted it to, so I've been feeling a little bit discouraged. So I thought, I'm gonna take a break and just go to the thrift store and maybe find some inspiration. But yeah, stay tuned for that video because that's gonna be a lot of fun, I think. I haven't decided yet if I'm gonna make it one long video or make it like a mini series where it's like multiple smaller videos, but Honestly, I would love to hear your opinion on that. Like, do you guys like long videos or do you prefer to watch, you know, many short videos? I'm kind of curious. I see train track. Go. Think there's a train on there? Maybe. Do you think there's a train on there? Somebody paint the ground. Did somebody paint the ground and the grass? Mmm. They might have. Alright. We are getting closer. We're almost there. Oh, look how beautiful it is outside today. So beautiful. We're here at the thrift store. Yeah, but I don't know what the you don't know what the thrift store looks like. What do you mean? Levi, where are we? Yeah. At the thrift store! <laughs> we are at the thrift store. There it is, over there. Yeah. I parked a little bit far, but that's okay. So I did make sure to bring my giant Ikea bag. <laughs> are you excited? Here, let's shut the door. Let's shut the door, but stay close to me, okay? Come on. 
Let's go see what the color of the day is. All right. That's really cute. Do you like that? That's really cute. Because it has a dinosaur on it. Oh, that one does have a dinosaur, but that one's a little small. Is that? Mom, I see the same bike. Come here. Mom, I see the same bike. That's really cool, Levi. We can go look at that toy shop. Okay. Look at that mailbox. Mom, I want to look at those toys. Mom, I Look at it. <laughs> Let's hit up the fabric. This is so cute. Look at the strawberry fabric, Levi. Oh my goodness. <gasps> okay, I'm definitely getting that. Levi, they have so much cute fabric today. Yeah. What the heck? Now we can look at the toys. Let's grab these scraps real quick. This is really cute, what the heck but I don't these? think that it's worth $7. Some of this fabric is so cute. Uh, I also don't feel like this one is worth $7. <gasps> That's fun. I know we're gonna go look at that in just a sec. Okay. Thank you for being such a good boy. <gasps> These pillows shams are super cute. They're like quilted. Also very cute. Are you hiding? Yeah, I'm is that an Elsa dress? Mm -hmm. For you. Look at this one, Levi. Alright, one second. We gotta park our cart. We have to go potty. Who do you think would like that? Always. Come here, baby. Uh, hey. I'm not seeing any cute shoes that I like. Mm. I, I found something for all of wow. them. Wow. Wow. They have a lot of cute stuff. This looks like a handmade skirt. And it's half off. Let's get it. Okay, we're gonna wrap it up because Elijah is starting to get kind of upset. So let's go look at the toys. Is it a treasure chest? But don't make a big mess. No messes. Mommy, can I have this Levi, look at this doctor set right here. This is brand new in a box. Mm -hmm. Levi, it's another Tonka truck. Yes. That's really cute. It's a little sewing machine, Levi. Mm -hmm. It's a tiny one. I wonder if it works. Look at the foot pedal. Mm. Whoa, that's cool. Let's go. Got it? Oh, I got it. You don't have to carry that, you can goose. That was fun. All right, let's go to the car. Oh, look at that big bag of stuff. Oh, Elijah. It's okay, baby. It's past his nap time, so he's a little fussy. I'm so happy with the way this bag turned out. All right. The heat? It's 80 degrees outside. 
say let's go. Go, go. Go, go. Go, go. Okay, that was fun. Okay. Did you guys have fun? I don't know if Elijah did. He was a little bit fussy, but that's okay. I had fun. You had fun? I also had fun. I love to thrift. So, I didn't get as much footage as I wanted to. Um, towards the end, I was kind of sorting through some of the stuff that I had initially put in my cart. And you guys didn't really get to see that, but that's because Elijah was being a little bit fussy. Um, but it's okay, I mean, it happens. It's like real life right there. <laughs> so, I'll have to show you guys when I get home what I thrifted. Let's see, the time is 11.40 right now, so we were in there for about an hour and a half. Yeah, it was about an hour and a half. Honestly, um, I could spend like hours in the thrift store, but when you have kids, it's a little trickier, and so you have to be mindful of, you know, their patience. But we're going to go home and get a little snack. I hear you yawning back there. You love your snake truck? Are you excited about your new um, shark truck? I'm pretty excited about that. What's Elijah doing? Is he sleeping? Nope. I will not be surprised if he's asleep by the time we get home. Almost home. You know what? Now that I think about it, I don't think I even thought to look at the blouses today. Like, I didn't even look for shirts. I just looked for dresses and skirts and fabric, mostly. <laughs> I find that, like, dresses and skirts are really easy project pieces, especially if you can find them, like, a couple size bigger. It's kind of funny because before you have kids, it's really easy to stay out all day and go to different shops and, like, in my mind, I thought maybe I would go to two different thrift stores today, but as it turns out, one thrift store is probably enough. Um, that's really like what my kids could bear. <laughs> All right, we're home and both of my boys fell asleep. Look at that sleepy guy. <laughs> the bag. Thrifty fit of the day, but now with more stuff. <laughs> All right. There's the stuff. A whole bag full. I am going to go hydrate and have a little snack before I show you guys what I got because honestly that took a lot of my energy and I just feel like I need a reset. Um, so I'll be right back. <laughs> mm. Okay, let's make this quick. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? I literally thrifted this um, thinking like it would be fun for the boys, but it's already broken, which is kind of sad, but I'll be able to fix it, so it's fine. But I'm a sucker for like children's toys, like especially wooden children's toys. Um, shake it some more. <laughs> but that was um, one of my thrifty finds. I thought that was adorable. Levi picked out this silly little shark truck, so. There's that. Um, let's see, what else, what else? This cute little wicker bag. Oh my goodness, it's perfect for springtime. I don't own anything like this. And it was only $6, which I thought was fair. Um, it feels like the strap is real leather. Let's see what it looks like on the inside. Oh, it's so cute on the inside. Look at that. 
So initially when I was thrifting, I was putting a lot of fabric in my cart because I got really excited. They had a ton of like denim fabric, but I ended up putting a lot of it back because I feel like it was kind of overpriced, but I did get this beautiful denim fabric. So this was $7 for this fabric and all of them for some reason were priced at $7. I don't know, was that worth $7? I don't know, but I like it and I think it's really cute. It's just a dark denim with cute little daisy flowers on it. So there's that. Okay, and then I also got this fabric because this fabric is so adorable. I love it. It's like perfect for spring. Like honestly, this could be turned into like a cute jacket or a cute blouse or something. I think this is duck fabric. Kind of feels a little bit canvassy, but um, not really sure. I mostly just liked the print on it. Look at that. Florals for spring. Okay, so here's a little skirt that I got. This is clearly a handmade piece. You can tell just based on that stitching right there. Like that is definitely a handmade piece and it looks pretty unfinished. Like it looks like whoever made this was going to finish it off with a button, but they didn't. The edges are not finished on the inside. But anyways, I just think that's really cute. For one, this was half off because it was a red tag. I get really excited when I see unfinished projects at the thrift store because I'm like, somebody was putting all this work into this and for some reason they gave up. So I'm gonna take it and finish it. But yeah, isn't that cute? I love the fabric. It's red with these cute little black and white flowers on it. My goodness. So this is like literally ripping at the seams as I try this on. Um, it barely fit over my hips. I think that's pretty cute. Honestly, like I might just add a button and finish it. Super, super cute. Okay, so here's a dress I thrifted. This was $6.49. It's really cute. I mean, I liked the fabric. I don't know how it's gonna fit, but either way, I was like, project piece. So, let's see. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. <laughs> I'm not 100% sure about the waistline. I feel like paired with a belt, it might be really cute. I think this could be really cute with boots. I've been like super into maxi skirts and maxi dresses over like tall boots. I think that's a whole vibe. I do really love the puff sleeves. I think that's adorable. There's another look at the fabric. Okay, so I thrifted a bathing suit. I have no idea if it's going to fit me. I just saw it the moment I walked into the store and I noticed it was a red tag, so I knew it was half off. This is it right here. I don't think I'm going to try this on for you guys. I thought the color was really cute. It's sheared, which is super cute. And actually what's funny about this, this reminded me of a project I just got done filming. Um, I was actually going to show you guys. This is the top and this is the bathing suit. And look how similar they are. Funny story, this is a little like bandeau top, however you say it, that I made from the top portion of the skirt. So more on that to come because that's one of the project pieces that I am working on for the other video I had talked about at the beginning. Those were both half off. So basically I paid $3.49 for the whole set. That's a good deal. Hopefully it fits me. Let's see. We're almost done. Okay, I got really excited when I saw this. This is a little Levi's denim skirt. I have no idea if this is gonna fit me, um, but I couldn't resist it. I'm super, super in love with denim and it still had its tags on it. This one was considered a boutique piece, so I paid $11.99 for this one. Let's go try it on. So this is actually fitting me. Okay guys, you have to see this. Hopefully you can see this from over there. It's basically just a denim skirt. It goes down to my knees and I think this will look super cute with some boots. Um, honestly, perfect fit, not a project piece. Do, 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 do. The concept is there, boots and denim skirt. Anyways, okay, here's a dress I thrifted. It's denim once again. Uh, once again, paid 650 for it. So, we'll see. Let's try it on. It's okay. I think the fit in the top is a little bit strange, but I could probably alter it. I also think that potentially pairing it with like a cardigan might be cute, so let me go grab something. Okay, like already this is looking so much better with a little cardigan. So actually this little um, cardigan blouse thing, I made it and I made a couple shorts about it. Well, I made two shorts about it. This is made from a thrifted turtleneck and all I did was basically cut it in half, remove the neckline and add some bias tape. So if you're interested, there's two shorts on how to make your own. I already like it. I think that's pretty cute. But yeah. Mm. 
Okay, last piece. It is this denim button up dress. I thrifted a lot of denim today, <laughs> now that I think about it. But there's that. Let's try it on, last piece. All right, so here's the last piece. I actually really like this. I honestly might just keep it this way. We'll see, I don't know how to style it yet, but I think it'll be really cute. I think I paid 650 for this one. The tag is somewhere, let's see. Yep, 650. But yeah, that's the last piece that I thrifted. That's pretty much it. I'm pretty happy with today's purchases. I ended up spending $61, which I don't think is pretty bad. Let's see, I got, I got about three to four yards of fabric, two dresses, no sorry, three dresses, two skirts, a bag, a bathing suit, and a couple of toys for my kids. So I feel like $61 is a pretty fair price. What do you guys think? Honestly, I think that my favorite piece that I thrifted today was this denim skirt. What was your favorite piece? I would love to know. I'm honestly pretty excited to style this. I'm definitely feeling a little bit more inspired to continue that other video I'm working on. So stay tuned for that. And if you guys are into this kind of content, like this whole vlogging style thrifting thing, I will be making more content like that in the future. So be sure to like and subscribe if that's your thing. My kids are still sleeping, <laughs> which is amazing. But yeah, thanks so much for watching guys. Bye.